Hi, this is Rishik Madhwarsu and I am contesting for the post of Member of Parliament of Grade 8. In this video, I will justify why you should elect me as a Member of Parliament for Grade 8 and what I will do to make Grade 8 a better place. What do I think about being a leader and what I believe are the qualities that should be possessed by a leader. To me, a leader is one among the people. He or she should be able to guide people when they need help and solve others' problems when they are in trouble. A leader should possess the right qualities to be respected and supported. A leader should be a good listener to others' problems. He should always make the right decisions and never regret them. Always use a win-win approach and think about the equal well-being of everybody and he should respect others' views and treat everybody equally and always be fair. Here are some of my qualities that I believe will make me a good leader. I am a very friendly person. I easily forgive and forget about the not so good things that my friends have done. I am very optimistic and jolly. I always try to achieve an all smiles environment. Whenever I see an argument happening, I try to stop my friends and make them reconcile with each other. I always like the thought of friends being together. Whenever I see my friends looking down, I try to show empathy and make them feel better. I like solving my friends problems to make them be happy. Reading books is one of my favorite hobbies. I learn a lot from different types of books. I also love learning and I also have a very curious mind. I am an open-minded person. I like collaborating with my friends and taking their inputs to make my work better. I always try to give feedback to my friends to help them improve with their work too. I am a confident and good public speaker. I have a record of participating in many speaking competitions. I have spoken on many pressing issues. Every leader should have some circumstances where they have displayed leadership skills. Here is how I have displayed leadership. Here are the initiatives that I have taken. I have participated in many community services. It's my duty to help in the betterment of mankind. We all say this every day in our pledge. I am inspired by the mantra Sarvodaya and this powers me to continue to participate in community services. Our school teaches us to imbibe good qualities in ourselves so that we become more successful in life. The schoolhouse that we follow every day in our school time is a perfect example of how to approach learning and how to work effectively. Let's see how I understand our school's approach and how I follow it. What do I think about our school's cultures? What do I believe? What do I understand while I follow them and how do I connect to them in real life? How do I believe that they are useful? Our inside out approach is character first, competence next. We have been hearing this for a long time. But what does it mean? We have to prioritize character first because a good character with the right qualities is necessary for working more productively and effectively. With more productive work, we can achieve greater things and with a pure mind, we can gain support and respect from everyone. 
and we can accomplish just so much more. How do I imbibe these qualities? Finally, why should you vote for me? My main goal as an MP this year is to integrate students' opinions and ideas and fun with learning to make it more enriching and enjoyable for each and every unique student. I want to give an amazing experience for every single student so that they enjoy learning in school. Here is my motto, let us all collaborate for learning to be successful. This year, let us all learn the fun way. My first goal this year is to reduce bullying. I want to make sure that every single fellow student of mine is treated fairly and is not teased or hurt. My next goal is to conserve the resources that we have. Let's all show how we can follow the stationary policy and show that we have the culture to conserve. I want to make sure that all of us save the stationery, whether it's books, papers, pens and pencils and keep it safe and organized. Let's all use our stationery wisely. Reading is an amazing habit. By making reading a habit every day, we can learn a lot of new things. One of my final main ideas is interest-based clubs. Students can choose the topics that they like and discuss them with other people in clubs. That way, they can learn a lot of new things by enriching their minds with fun activities and collaboration too. Finally, I would like to consult all my teachers, friends and seniors and implement new ideas that will make grade 8 a better place. If you think I'll make the right decisions and I'm an eligible leader, please vote for me.